If you think about it, you can feel yourself getting a little heavier, getting a little bit more heavier, getting a little bit more heavier. And the longer you keep it, you end up down here on the ground like this, like, help, somebody help. You want to be transparent because it's not only freedom, healing, and deliverance for you, but it's somebody else's key as well. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you are now tuned into Jaja's Mic, home of the world's toughest leaders. It's a pleasure to have you. <laughs> Today, I'm bubbly. I'm excited because I have a phenomenal individual with me, and she's here today to speak to you about transparency. I met her at Bedroom Coffee the other day, doing my edits, bouncing up and down. Y'all know my favorite spots, coffee shops. And she approaches me. She's a busy woman. She, it was real quick. I give her my card, but today we get to sit down and have a phenomenal, 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 uh, really what I call a moment of introspection. Cause I got a lot of kind of affirmations that I need to hear deep. And the reason is she's a woman of transparency. She's somebody who you just can't have a surface level conversation. It's not going to happen. And today I'm just excited to introduce you to this individual. So before I get into the mode of just talking and taking her spot right now, <laughs> right now what I'm going to do is I want to introduce you. So without further ado, I introduce you to Ty Marty. So I'm gonna do the pop in since he does the twirling. I'm gonna do the pop in. So I'm popping in, I'm dropping in to give you guys a Thai nugget for today, for this week, for this month, for the rest of your life, however you wanna apply that thing, okay? So today, the Thai nugget is gonna be about transparency and how transparency is your superpower. Now let's talk about this for a second. Now why is transparency important? Because it brings cleansing and healing to the soul, the mind, the heart, the spirit. It purifies, it brings in light, it brings in truth. Now what happens when we're not transparent? We become bound by secrets, by our past, by hurt, by pain, by unforgiveness. All of these different colors and arrays of emotions that we don't want to talk about. Why don't we want to talk about it? Because we feel like we'll be judged. We feel like we'll be condemned. We feel like, I don't know, people will think whatever they think because maybe we need to be delivered from a people-pleasing spirit as well. You know what I'm saying? That's a whole nother topic, whole nother conversation, whole nother day. But back to the transparency. You want to be transparent because it's not only freedom, healing, and deliverance for you, but it's somebody else's key as well. Somebody else is bound and you are the key to their freedom by you telling and sharing your story, your trials, your tribulations, the things that you come through, the things that God has delivered you from, the things that God has brought you through. And then when you tell your story, it gives other people permission to set themselves free as well. And it also reminds us all that we're not alone. What you're going through right now, I guarantee you about 1.5 million other people on the planet somewhere in this world are going through it as well. Why? Because we're all connected and it's all a circular thing. What goes around comes around. So you're either going into something, going through something, or coming out of something. And once you come out of that thing, you're about to be going through something else. So it's this endless cycle that keeps going and going and going. So you are not alone. And I want to remind you today that you are not alone. When you open up and share and release that thing, you bring light, you bring illumination into the dark places, which displaces the lies of the enemy. It shuts it down. The spirit of truth comes in. And you want that spirit of truth to be a crown on your head. You want to wear that thing every day, all day. That's your crown, spirit of truth. Come on, come on and lead me, guide me, and direct me in all things. But here's the deal, guys. I want you to know that you're supported. You are not the only one who's been through it. There's no need to be ashamed. There's no need to be embarrassed. That is a trick and a lie of the enemy to keep you in bondage and captivity. Just think about how much that thing weighs right now. If you're holding something right now, I want you to think about how much is weighing you down. If you think about it, you can feel yourself getting a little heavier, getting a little bit more heavier, getting a little bit more heavier. And the longer you keep it, you end up down here on the ground like this, like, help, somebody help. All right, so anyway, you get my point, you get what I'm trying to say. Open up, release that thing, release the burden, give it to God, give it to a friend, 
give it to a counselor to somebody but you need to release that rock you're not meant to carry it everything in this life is meant to be released you receive it and then you release it it's just like when you physically eat food your body has to physically release it when you physically drink fluid your body has to physically release it when you physically feel pain your body needs to physically release it whether it be through tears screaming maybe you need to punch a wall in a little bit whatever that is if you need to scream scream like in a quiet place like in your car with the windows up so nobody thinks anything is happening to you and they don't call police or anything like that but you know what i mean go out in the middle of the forest get it out just get it out release that thing so you can be free so you can help other people be free so you can give other people permission to be free that's my tie nugget for today be transparent open up break the yoke release the bondage break the bondage release yourself from captivity the door is open you have the key it's already unlocked all you got to do is walk on out come on <laughs> come on Mmm. -hmm.